but I'm still hoping and guessing it's the Disney Infinity pack, but I don't understand the size of this package, but let's continue. Let's continue to see what we can discover. My God, it is the Disney Infinity. Wow, awesome. <laughs> Why this big? I have no idea guys. I'm still surprised about the size of this package. Hey guys, welcome back. So yeah, that was me in September 2014. Welcome back to what I like to call my series about Disney Infinity or as you've seen in the title, the Disney Infinity Reconnect 2020. Uh, I think so we've done the video about uh, Disney Infinity first edition. This is the second e edition obviously. This was the first thing that I bought of this uh, Disney Infinity 2.0. The collector's uh, edition. And it was big when it was delivered. I was so surprised. I didn't know why or what to expect. Uh, but turned out um, it was for a reason because it contained a lot of stuff. So uh, in this package was included of course the Marvel superheroes. Uh, the Iron Man, Thor, Captain America, Hulk Eye, Hulk, and uh, Black Widow. And like I said, it was released uh, here in Europe in September of 2014, even before it was released in the US. So um, that was amazing. I was so thrilled, so happy to have it. And it was released on PlayStation 3 and PlayStation 4. And one of the things why... Um, this package was so big is because of the base because this is a c collector's edition the um, give the buyers in this uh, in this box a very very beautiful base which is this monster that you will be fighting against later on in the game uh, and it's like I said it's also a base where you can store your figurines uh, on it was just I loved it when I saw it uh, however, it's too big to have it around, so it is in the attic, but um, that's why I'm showing you this old video of 2014 when I got it and unboxed it. I loved it, still do, and I'm very, very careful with it. And of course, what's also included in this uh, pack is, just like with any other started pack, is the game, the Marvel's The Avengers playset, um, which is based, of course, on The Avengers. There is a standalone version of it that was released uh, later on in 2014. But yeah, so in this playset, Loki collaborating with MODOK is freezing New York and the Avengers must, the Avengers must stop them uh, while battling Frost Giants. And that's what I told you about, the, the monster in the base. The monster that we used in the base is actually one of these Frost Giants that will come out come out from the ground and attack you later on in the game so and it also comes as a standalone playset for uh, players who have a digital version or the Disney toy box uh, bundle pack it also contains um, the disc with the assault on Asgard which is a, de a defense based toy box uh, game um, what else and it has another game which is the escape from the Kylan which is a dungeon adventure type uh, toy box game based of course on the uh, Guardians of uh, the Galaxy. And um, other stuff that were included uh, were you know the standard things like web code card for all the characters and a uh, special limited edition Avengers themed poster. But that my friends was only the beginning because we eventually got a lot more for this uh, Disney Infinity 2.0 edition. A lot of stuff came out. This was maybe the most expanded edition of the three. So let's start. So we got the starter pack as I just showed you. Uh, here you see the starter pack um, without the special edition items. So like I said, the 2.0 edition gave us eventually a lot of stuff. Not only one starter pack, but two. What you're looking at is the toy box starter pack. And it includes the Disney Infinity 2.0 game and the Infinity Base, which are standard stuff that you get uh, in, in all the packs. And then it, it includes Stitch and uh, Merida. And it also includes two toy box games. One being the Stitch Tropical Rescue and the other one is Brave Forest Siege. 
Something else that's in this starter pack is this awesome, amazing poster that you see right now. I just love it. So, the back of both posters in both starter packs looks like this. And this is supposed to help you, you know, keep track of what you have so far or what you still have uh, to get. And I'm talking mainly about the power discs. Next, we have the Disney Infinity Marvel Super Heroes Power Disc Album Bundle. That's a long title. So, the bundle includes the massive Power Disc Album. It's really big. As well as five Power Discs, which are the Yondu Team Up and four Texture Discs, which are the Star Lord's Galaxy, Groot's View, Groot's Roots, and the Rip. And again, it's massive and it holds 40 power discs in total. Next, we have this. The Disney Infinity 2.0 Marvel Super Heroes Power Disc Album Bundle. Again, holds up to 40 power discs. So, and uh, with this album, again, it's a huge album. With this album, you get two toy box, uh, two toy box power discs which are the Hydra motorcycle which gives you something to ride or drive and the Lola Shields hover car and you get three custom slash ability power discs one being the Sentinel of Liberty the other one is shield uh, helicarrier strike which is more like an event not just a costume and the last one is the Marvel up Winter Soldier if you guys want to know what is what please go back to the first video that I made explaining to you how all this actually works when it comes to the mechanics. One thing that um, I don't like about these albums that they've been uh, bringing out for the first edition, the second edition, is that it's a shame that they do not complete each other. So meaning that um, it's all crisscross. You can have the same, you can have different album bundles, but then they have the same the power discs that you have to put in there, if you know what I mean. So it's not like they you that they complete each other, but it's more like all over the place. Next, we have this one again, a huge album. Same thing, uh, holds up to forty uh, power discs. This one comes also with five uh, power discs that you get for free when you buy it. Um, two for the toy box. Uh, have to do with the Spider-Man world so you get the Spider-Man streets which is for the texture and you get the Spidey sky which is of course like the name says it, the sky and then you get the vehicle the spider cycle vehicle power discs this one is really rare uh, that's why it also has uh, the orange um, color you also get the alien symbiote which is a costume so it, it, it changes the costume and sometimes can give you an, uh, an ability uh, what else? Um, I think that was it. I think that was it from what I'm seeing right now. Um, oh yeah, no, there's one, there's one, one that I forgot about, which is the Marvel Team Up White Tiger, which is a Team Up power disc. Meaning you can use two of them on top of each other when you use them on the base. Again, you guys, if you don't understand the mechanics of this, please go to the fir uh, first video that uh, uh, we shared with you here on our YouTube channel of this series of the Disney Infinity. Next, we have the Super, the Marvel Superheroes Power Disc Binder. This one is really boring. And uh, when I saw this, I knew that things were not going as great as they used to be. So, because it's really boring and it's really basic. Uh, this is not something that belongs into a toy collection. This is something that belongs in the cabinet of your office, at office. It's really boring. But yeah, I had to get it uh, because, you know, the but the collecting bug <laughs> but um yeah so this is this is really the least uh the, the least favorite of the stuff that i got for the disney infinity uh 2.0 uh, i'm sorry the disney infinity yeah 2.0 edition it's just very basic it's, it's not very creative you know it's just there it is it's just a binder so next we have this exclusive Toys Are Us, as you can see, the sticker on it, the Marvel Superheroes uh, album uh, bundle. This one is medium size, 
um, the same size as the one that they brought out for the first edition and it holds only 21 power discs uh, this one doesn't give you any um, power discs uh, free that comes with it you just get the album and uh, that's it but still it's nice and um, very exclusive by the way we're now in December of 2020 at this point you guys it's almost impossible to find any of these especially the one that I showed you a bit earlier with Captain America on the front that one is basically not existing anymore not on eBay not on the internet I don't want to discourage you guys but just giving you some extra facts now that we're sharing this with you next we have these Disney Originals album bundle this one is also a big holds up to 40 power discs uh, plus the two uh, toy box games um, from what I remember when I was unboxing it uh, what you get is these five power discs which are let me see so we have the um, I love these by the way and the music that that you can create with these uh, in your um, toy box sorry guys sometimes I'm a little bit distracted so we have what do we have here we have the Main Street electrical parade float so this is a vehicle that you can use in the toy box uh, what else what else what else do we have here we have Alice in Wonderland's caterpillar which is also a vehicle uh, I see Mr. Toad Ride, but I, I don't know. I don't think that's that's the name of it. Let me think. Let me think. What was the name of that? Oh, I don't remember you guys. Really sorry. Oh yeah, Mr. Toad's motor car, which is also a vehicle. And then these very very cute uh, small world uh, texture and sky power discs. So one is Skies of the World, gives you the sky. And um, the other one is, I keep forgetting it, a small world, uh, just small world, that's the name of it. And it gives you the texture. So if you use these, uh, these two together, as I said, in the toy box, you'll be in the small world world, including the music that you hear when uh, you're on this ride at Disney World, Disneyland, or whatever. So these are really cute. This was very, very hard to get, this one. Especially this with the Disney Originals. Um, you really, need, you really need to be very, very lucky to get your hands on one of these still in this day. Something else that they brought out, you know, to store your power discs is what you see right now, what they call the Disney Infinity Marvel Super Heroes Power Discs Capsule. Uh, I really didn't care for it. So they have them in orange and in blue and um, I didn't care for it. And I showed them to Mike, he didn't either. So I didn't, I, I ended up not buying them. Um, because they were just, you know, like the binders, there's no creativity in it. It's just, this is it. Guys, I almost forgot about this one. See, I was confused and I think uh, you might be too. You might be thinking uh, that I showed you this before in the video, but no, trust me, it's not the same. Yes, it's almost exactly the same art, only instead of uh, the sources Mickey, you have Aladdin's, uh, Aladdin standing here. And on this one, look, Aladdin is um, behind Hero. See, he's all the way in the back. And now you see Mickey in the front. And uh, yes, this part didn't change. It still has Merida holding her uh, bow and arrow. But this one is again, a huge album. Again, 40 power discs. It can hold plus two games, I think. I'm not really sure. Um, let me see, this one came with the Lion King toy box texture, so it was this one, and um, where's the other Lion King? We have them all, so we must have them here, and I'm not crazy. Anyway, oh yeah, here it is, see? It's beautiful, so you get this rock uh, as a backdrop, it's really beautiful. Uh, you got Aladdin. You get this one and you get one that was really, really hard to find. This uh, Cyborg Swarm, which is for the sky. I think it was this one. These are really very, very, very hard to find. So I think this is it. 
these were all the uh, album uh, bundles that we brought out, um, including the Toy Story. And one of the ones that I just shared with you was actually, I think if I'm not mistaken, exclusively for Walmart. But I'm not sure. But uh, there was definitely one exclusive for the Toys R Us. It had the, the sticker so you could tell which one. But this is it. This is all the album bundles that uh, were brought out for the second edition for the Disney Infinity 2.0. And I love them. Again, you guys, I don't want to poke your eyes out. But if you don't have them by now, you probably won't be able to get all of them. Uh, I mean, like I said, the one with Captain uh, America on the front. It's not even, it's, it doesn't even exist on the internet. It's just pictures and thumbnails. Anyway, uh, but this is not all, of course. These are not all the accessories for the Disney Infinity 2.0. Of course, we still have the figurines and the play sets. I'm going to share that with you and wrap this video up. So, when it comes to figurine in the Disney Infinity 2.0 edition, this is it. This is what you see here. And it's a lot. Starting by Aladdin, Baymax, Black Widow, Captain America, Donald Duck, Drax, Falcon, Gamora, Green Goblin, Groot, Hawkeye, Hero, Hulk, Iron Fist, Iron Man, Jasmine, Loki, Maleficent, Merida, Nick Fury, Nova, Quora, Racket Raccoon, Ronan, Sam Flynn, Spider-Man and the Spider-Man Black Suit, Star-Lord, Stitch, Thor, Tinkerbell, Venom, and Yandu. So when it comes to playsets, they brought out three playsets for this edition. One is the Marvel, the Avengers, which comes with the Widow, Loki, uh, Thor, Iron Man, Hulk, which is a crossover character, the Falcon, Captain America, and Hawkeye. And this is the other set. This, this is the Spider-Man comics play set. So what you have here is Spider-Man, you know, the original one, then Spider-Man, the black suit. You have Iron Fist, you have Nova, you have the Goblin, Nick Fury, and Venom. And the third and last playset is the Guardians of the Galaxy playset. So we have Gamora, Rocket Raccoon, we have Drax, Yondo, Groot, Star Lord, and Ronan in the back. And Rocket Raccoon is also a crossover character, meaning you can play with him outside of this playset. You can just for example, in one of the others. Guys, um, when it comes to showing you all the power disks that come within the 2.0 edition, there's really no nice, cool, elegant way. So what I decided to do is log in into the console and um, you know go to the, se the section of the game, what they call the Disney Infinity Collection, where the um, present to you all the power disks and all the figurines that you have uh, registered so far in this case we have them all so please just concentrate on uh, the ones that have 2.0 on them enjoy